you want to feel special, you want to feel important, you want to feel like your priority. You want somebody to treat you like a queen or the king that you are. Woo! Finally, I can start the video. Hi, guys! This video, I want to make it very empowering. What am I doing? <laughs> Honestly, I just want to talk about value. Value. Ooh, ooh. You. Val. You. <laughs> okay, I'm so funny. I learned a lot of things through dating. Usually in dating, you're trying to find somebody who can see your value, right? You want to be treated nicely. You want to feel special. You want to feel important. You want to feel like your priority. You want somebody to treat you like a queen or the king that you are, right? And we struggle a lot with that. Well, I do. <laughs> but hopefully no more. I'm gonna put a stop to this, okay? Value, value, value. Remember, your value. So, how can he see my value if I don't see my value? How can somebody respect me if I don't respect me first? How can somebody love me if I don't love me first? Let me just say something. A respectful person will be respectful whether you are respectful or not. And what is important is that you value you. Value your time, value your energy, value your heart, value your mind, your body. It's really believing in yourself believing that you are powerful, you have magic in you, you're not nothing, you are something. Us women, we have intuition. That's our superpower and you have to start believing in yourself, honey, <laughs> okay? Your intuition tells you everything if you just listen. In a, some situation that is not right or something bad is about to happen when somebody is trying to trick us or we can feel it and we have to start listening to that feeling don't ignore it and don't let some guy make you doubt yourself okay lena <laughs> never again never again so people will try to make you doubt yourself and be like no it's because you 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 have issues you have this you have this you have that you have to start trusting yourself okay who doesn't have issues? We all have issues, honey. But it doesn't mean that right now what I'm feeling is wrong. I have a feeling and it exists for a reason. And I know that something is wrong, so don't lie to me and I will always know, Mr. Amazing. Do you feel the power that I'm feeling right now? <laughs> great, 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 great. So, so we have to value your energy, your time. Oh my God, I want to talk about this. Time. You have to value your time. Who do you spend your time with? What do you spend your time doing? What are the things that you are spending most of your time? Who do you allow into your life? Who do you allow to stay? Okay, sometimes things happen, okay? Yeah, you don't want to bring drama to your life. You don't want that. But maybe what you want is to grow. What you really, really want is to be more strong. What you really want is to be more tough <laughs> and you can handle things, right? And maybe what you want is more wisdom and that's why you're attracting these bad things into your life. But it doesn't mean that, oh, I have to beat yourself about it. No, huh? no. Instead of seeing that the universe is against me, everybody's against me, everybody hates me, the world is trying to make me miserable, um, I have bad luck. Instead of seeing it from this negative way, try to see it in a more positive way and see it like these are lessons. This is gonna make me grow. This is what's gonna make me more strong and powerful. This is what I need. Otherwise, if these things didn't happen, I wouldn't have learned my value. I wouldn't have learned how to love myself more. Change your mindset. Change the way you look at things. Just just be like, okay, you know what? This is it's really horrible what's happening, but let me try and look at it in a more positive way. Is there anything, anything that I can 
take out of this? Is there anything positive about what's happening? Anything. Think about it and then you start to see that there are lessons there, valuable lessons that you can't really learn in school or anything. These are experiences, valuable experiences. <laughs> so really, when you have faith that, you know what, no, the world is with me. The universe is with me. God is with me. Everything is with me. Everything is trying to really help me reach my potential. It's guiding me, it's protecting me. The fact that you are alive, you have a gift, so use it. Value, value the fact that you have time. How are you gonna use that? Are you gonna spend it being in a bad relationship or in a bad job or surrounding yourself with bad people? No, 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 no. Valuing yourself, valuing your time means that you have to take some steps, make some good decisions and get yourself out of the misery, okay? Come on, you can do it. It might take some time, probably will take some time, but as long as you take at least one tiny little step every single day, then you're gonna get there, okay? Believe me, I did it and you can do it. So when you're in a bad job, you're, it's really not your fault. You didn't know that your boss is gonna be evil. You didn't know that your coworkers is gonna be like this, bullying you. You didn't know that all of this is gonna happen, but now you know. Now you know that this is bad for you. Now it's your responsibility to get out. It's the same thing when you're in a relationship. Do you stay or do you leave? Now that's your responsibility. That what shows how much you value yourself. Let's talk about valuing your health. Your health, what are you putting in your body? It's not like I eat healthy all the time. Most of the time I do, I eat healthy. But you just gotta pay attention to how you are treating yourself first. If you want somebody to treat you right, then you have to treat yourself right first. Make sure that you are taking care of your health. No, it's really none of our fault okay we grew up with a lot of negative thoughts a lot of negative behaviors we had we didn't we don't know we don't know better but now it's time for us to train ourselves to practice every day to have more faith to have more optimism i'm gonna say this in arabic nobody's happiness is more important than your happiness but also, remember, yours is not more important than theirs. We, are, we all deserve to be happy. We all deserve to be happy. But you have to recognize the difference between what is your responsibility and what isn't. Your happiness is your responsibility. Okay, so stop complaining and start planning. Start making decisions. Start working on, on yourself, on your growth. Maybe a lot of people will be like, oh, that's selfish. No, it's actually selfless. Because the more you work on yourself, the better person you become, right? And when you're a better person, you become an example to the people around you. And then other people try to be like good like you, and they try to be good, good like you. <laughs> I said the same thing. <laughs> so they try to be better too. And this way, you're actually making the world a better place. So don't tell me that this is selfish. Don't tell me that valuing yourself and, and loving yourself is selfish. No, it's actually a selfless act. So go love yourself. <laughs> value yourself. Remember your value. I love you guys. I hope uh, you enjoyed the video. <laughs> Don't forget to like and subscribe <laughs> and the blue button and my Patreon if you would like to support me. The link is in the description. And okay, thank you so much, and I will see you in the next video. Bye. There's no